basically, um, the main problem there was that the initial vulture that Haya had at the front for some reason didn't see the Lings moving out. I didn't quite see how the Lings sl slipped out, but the whole point of when you're going for vulture expand, or sorry, one factory expand, is the initial vulture slash vultures must stop all Zerglings. Those are your those are your only scouting and and your only defense against initial attacks, right? And so that he didn't see it with the, the first Vulture is like so 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 bad. Anyway, we're going straight into game number 4 it looks like. No ad breaks this time. No time for more analysis. And here we go. What, is this Pamir Plateau or whatever it's called? Uh, looks like it might be. I think it is actually. Nice. Okay. Sorry, I missed the spawn location actually, so... Okay, it looks like Killer's bottom left, Haya is in fact bottom right. Awesome. Score is 2 to 1. It's a best of 5. It was announced as a best of 7, but it is now best of 5. So Haya is one game away from defeat, but the Fisher King is in serious mode. By the way, so far, uh, so we, so the first two games we saw very standard one racks expand versus three hatch openings. Last game we saw uh, we saw a curious one fact expand from Haya, possibly due to him, you know, maybe not liking Andromeda for the long game that much, trying to do something different. But I haven't seen the proxy racks. And I haven't seen nukes. I I, I want to see one or the other. Okay, it looks like it's not going to be proxy racks. Maybe I don't want to see proxy racks. Maybe not. But I want to see a nuke. More importantly, I want to see a nuke rush win. I want to see Haya nuke rush here, win the game, and then like play an epic hour-long TBZ in game number five. I think I think that would be the ideal situation here. Actually. Game number 5 is going to be on 2-player map, isn't it? It's going to be on Heartbreak Ridge, I think. Ooh, if this actually goes to game 5, I think Haya might have the advantage, because Heartbreak Ridge is actually quite difficult for, for ZVT in the long game. So if Haya does actually win here, he will have a pretty good chance, I think, uh, in, taking this, in taking this series. Anyway, we do have 12 patch once again from Killer, and he's going to correctly uh, drone scout in the correct direction as well. It's going to be quite nice. <laughs> Meanwhile, Haya looks like he's doing a one rack expand again. Doesn't have the gas yet. And. Whoa! 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 I wish they would click the SCV. Please click it. Click it! Click it! Oh, okay, it's actually not that bad. Okay, he's got 10, 10 HP left. Man, SCVs have a lot of HP. You see how many times that drone spit on him? Oh man, he must be like covered in drone phlegm. Probably pretty disgusting. But at least he's not dead. Like acidic drone phlegm. Ugh. Ugh. Anyway, there is the third hatchery. And. Whoa, for a second I thought the stream froze. Did he just freeze for a second there? Am I just crazy? That was weird. Trippy. Anyways. So... Do do do, one direct expand versus three hatch. Nice. Standard. Just means we have to you know, chill for a couple minutes before anything crazy happens. Having said that... Hai is moving out with his initial two marines. This is a very risky maneuver. I mean, two marines will just get eaten alive by four zerglings. Uh, even two zerglings can, can just pick that guy off. Oh my god, what the shit? Why would you one racks expand and then SCV bunker rush and lose your marine? Oh my god, he oh, What? Are you kidding me, Haya? Dude! We gotta see a game five! You better win this right now! Oh my god, I swear to god, Haya, if you don't win this game now. Oh my god, and he's going back! It was completely useless! Oh, dude! What? Oh, 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 man. Okay, well, okay, on the plus side, he forced a lot of links. I don't know why he's not building a bunker right now. He must know that he's forced a lot of Zerglings. Why is he not bunkering? Why are you not bunkering? Build a bunker immediately, right now. 
Please, please, Haya, please, go to the bunker. Oh my god, please. Uh, th that's not a bunker, man. Uh, that's, that was close. It, that does cost 100 minerals. You should build the other one, though. No, no, did, come on, build it. Please. Uh, actually, it's not that many links. I thought there would be more links. Maybe it's okay. Oh, maybe not. Oh, maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe not! Maybe not, not Blockhead! Oh my god! That SCV spawned at exactly the right time for that CC. Holy shit, did you see? <laughs> Whoa! Oh my god. The fact that the SCV popped out and was just happened to be in the right position and the SCV building the bunker was on the top side. Now, Haya is so ridiculously lucky. Because if either of those SCVs was not in the correct position, the links could have ran through. That is the... <laughs> The bunker SCV was perfectly at the top, and then the command center SCV perfectly popped out as well. Dang. Oh man, I'm gonna have a heart attack. Jeez, bad for my blood pressure. Okay, so <laughs> we've got a Spire now. Looks like we're gonna calm down a little bit. We're gonna calm down, gonna go into the mid game. So, you know, both players suffered a bit of damage here. So obviously, Haya threw away a couple of early Marines. He lost a lot of mining time with the SCVs. But he also forced Killer to make a lot of, well, decent number of Zerglings. He made like a control group of Zerglings. So it's not like Killer, you know, was completely unaffected. He did, you know, have to uh, sacrifice some drug production there. And... Oh my goodness, no way! No way! Killer got Burrow! <laughs> he got Burrow! Oh my god! This game... This game, Killer, 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 Killer. Now, oh man, he's, he's even, you see, he, and the thing is, he very cleverly left some links unborrowed as well, so there's no way the high is going to suspect this. Now the question is, does he actually use those links to, uh, to surround these marines and kill it, or does he backstab? With three firebats there, oh my god, there's four firebats! Okay, uh, he should not unborrow until the army's like halfway across the map, and then he should backstab. He should not try and engage here, he should just wait. Be very patient, let the army move halfway across the map, unburrow, snap him off. Oh, wait, 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 but the mutas are here! He can actually kill it now that the mutas are here, but I'm gonna have four firebats. I've never seen that many firebats this early. Four firebats is insanely good. I think it's like a really smart by high because he knows that killer made a lot of links, and every link is now borrowed! I'm freaking out! Where is the unborrowed? He can't do it yet. There's too many marines. It's just too strong. And when Ling's on Burrow, they like pause for a second without attacking. Yes, he counterattacked with those things. Okay, he did backstab. He still got some Ling's barred on the map, but he's gonna he's gonna whittle down this big marine force. But man, look at this. There's nothing in the bunker. Marines can't get to the bunker. The counterattack is doing huge damage. And here we go. This marine force is all high as gone right now. He's gonna do a lot of damage with this. He's losing everything in his natural. He's moving forward. How good is the the Muta Micro? It looks like some emergency events. Oh my god, but the counterattack! How many summons are there? Killer's got two summons. Is it enough? It's very close. I think with the mutas there, the two summons will be enough. And it looks like it looks like the force has been whittled down. Enough has it? I think it has. Meanwhile, two links are still killing SCVs in the natural expansion. Oh Haya Haya is in a lot of trouble right now. The only saving grace for him is that Killer has not taken a third base yet. Normally he would have taken a third now, and oh my god, even borrowed the links there. Oh god, so obnoxious from Killer. But here we go. That Marine Force is looking very, very small right now. Only one firebat left as well. Killer with some fantastic muta control as well. And now has enough to just pick off the rest. Although the last couple of rains are gonna, gonna fight to the bitter end here. And with a few links coming out as well, does does Hyatt even have enough of his natural to survive the counterattack? Is he just gonna die right now? Okay, looks like he does have a decent number of marines. No medics left. But with the with those turrets going up in the bunker in the front, I think he's okay. He's actually lost a depot there though, so he doesn't have a wall anymore. And it looks like, oh, Killer's going for it! Is that the best idea? The bunker's going down, the SCVs were not there in time! Killer's going for the win! GG! Killer! With the ki- Oh my god, Killer! Losing the first game, coming back, taking the next three, stomping the Fishy King into the ground. Killer is the champion of the Sonic Star League number 8, winning back-to-back -back SSLs after retiring from professional Brood War. What an amazing player here. I cannot believe it. Wow. 
Wow, wow, wow. And what a series that was. Great, 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 great games. Oh, man. All right. Man, Kill Kill he seems, uh, seems pretty chill. He's pretty calm. He does just another day at the office. You know, winning a Star League, no big deal. No bigs. No bigs. Ooh, all right, interview time, interview time. All right, where's Kamolian? Where's Kamolian at? Let's do some interviewing.